Hi everyone, this is Killshot from 999 Gaming. I want to do a video for The Walking Dead Road to Survival, and this is Telltale Part 3, Act 2, Stages Number 4 and 5. And this is where it ramps up a little bit more. These are dual bandit stages, so be prepared. You're going to go human versus human. I know the mix is going to change a little bit. I saw a lot of red and blue combinations, not knowing this in advance, but um, I'm still going to take my all red team in there and just gear it up to handle humans. So I'm going to switch out a couple items. I'm going to get my hollow points in there instead of my sharpshooters. And I'm going to sit Amy down and bring Lori for that all important protective shot that we like to use. But you're going to see the uh, NPC that comes along with us is always kind of in the red zone. So you can see Lee uh, down to his last legs there, about 20%. I'm going to try to minimize the items that I use, but um, replenishment is uh, something I used on a pretty regular basis here, just waiting on Dale and baby Rick's heels to uh, generate with the uh, adrenaline rush. So you can see wave number two, once again, red and blue combo. A little bit more red this time, so that's, uh, you know, at least that's a standoff. We'll take the two blue down pretty easily there, and still no items really needed to be used on this stage. Wave number three is, is where it ramped up a little bit more. This is where I have three blue. Went ahead and took those down pretty early. Got the multi-shot. And now it's just red versus red. Go ahead and get Dale's heel there. You can see the, the heels are kind of timely. Here we got a little bit of red and yellow. I'm going to go ahead and turn the tides. Give us that extra attack boost. I want to get this protective shot. Get this healer down in the middle. And now just versus the red. While I'm waiting on the other stuff to recharge, going to go ahead and use replenish. They love to target Lee. The green Lee. My, uh melee warrior there so here we are the fifth and final wave and fifth and final wave you got the healer in the middle going to take that down and we got everybody pretty much uh low at this point and we'll go ahead and finish off wave number five so moving on to the next wave and i'm always out of food storage right this one got a little bit tougher uh we brought kenny along for the uh the ranged npc and once again we're dealing with these blue right off the start and i know they're going to hit a little bit harder so I'm just going to go ahead and lower the attack because I don't want to take too much damage and just always be behind. And there's the protective shot. That's going to help out quite a bit. Go ahead and use these replenishment once again. And we got good heals going into the second wave, so we're in pretty good shape here. Wave number two, once again, red and blue. Multi-shot, pretty nice hit there. I lowered the defense at the top, just that multi-shot hits a little bit harder. Wanted to take those down, and no issues there. Everybody's pretty much topped off at this point. Uh, green and yellow here, and go ahead and turn the tides. Get a nice protective shot. You can see that's a nice one shot there. Get all these green out of the way before the healer gets a chance to top them back off. And then we'll go ahead and take that down in a nice six-on-one scenario. So we are smoking right along here. This was where it, it a little bit dicey on paper. You know, i got a lot of blue characters here, so I went ahead and lowered the defense right off the start. Want to get these blue out of the way as quick as possible. So take those first two blue down, pop Kenny's Adrenaline Rush, and we're at a pretty good spot here. So I got a little lazy in the fifth wave, i got to be honest, because I saw you know green and yellow, and usually it's a pretty good combination. And I let Kenny get down a little bit low, and oh my god, they killed Kenny, you bastards! You know, it was coming, right? Eventually, if you use Kenny long enough, you're going to have to get a South Park reference in there. So... Super slow motion, you can see. Not only did they kill Kenny there, but they actually hit him after he was already dead. So, yeah, I had to watch that several times. It looked like a, a one-two shot. So it looked like uh, the X was through his name before he even took the second shot. But uh, that was a little bit cruel. Thanks, everyone, for watching. My name's Killshot. This is stages number four and five. I'll get the rest of them up for you guys soon. Give this video a thumbs up. Peace.